Magenta Canada and CNM Seeds present the Wheat School on RealAgriculture.com. So one of the really tough things about wheat is trying to stage it for fusarium control. And we really do need to time it appropriately. The problem is that wheat, at least in Ontario, is never uniform. I so wish we could figure out how to get that perfect uniform stand. But here's an excellent example in this particular field. So we, here's three wheat heads that I pulled out of this particular crop and they're all at a little bit different stage. So this particular head you can see is just reaching day zero. If you look at the flag leaf there, you can see the flag leaf and the head has just cleared that flag leaf. So perfect day zero. We have another one here that's at about day minus two. We have a little, about a third of the head above. The rest of that head is still down below. And here we have one at about day minus three because this particular head, it's just, the ons are, are just starting to emerge. It's gonna take about three days in order to get there. So when we, when we do that, and this is a uniform field. If you look at this particular field, you would look at this field and say, wow, this is nice and uniform up here, and it's gonna be easy to stage. If you get into Lambton County with tile run wheat, it's unbelievable because over the tile runs, it will be like this. Between the tile runs, it's probably still looking something like this, where we have wheat that's, that still has the head way down here, and that wheat is at least six or seven days, maybe even as much as 10 days away from heading. So staging wheat for fusarium control is never easy. The window is day one to day six. And so if you're trying to do a variable field and you're looking at this as your most advanced head, so that day zero head, and you're looking at other wheat that's kind of in that day minus six or, or day minus whatever, you kind of say, okay, I'd really like this head to be emerged. This one's perfect now, so let's wait four days. This one will be partially emerged, or most of them will be emerged, because they have to be out to give me control. After day four from this one, we start giving up control, because the, the fusarium products we use have no reach back, if you will, and if it's infected, we won't get the same level of control. At this stage, I can get 60% control, maybe even a little bit better on a resistant variety. At this stage, I get 0% control. So if I get this one to day six, I still get 30% control there. If this guy is now head emerged, I can get 60% control there. It's a real balancing act and one of the toughest thing to, things to do in terms of wheat production in Ontario. Mm -hmm.